a fairly nice skull here in just a short amount of cordum. And here, section of the jaw. And here again is just a, another elongated triangular form. That fits in there. Actually, these are really pretty good uh, videos. Uh, Jeff uh, Wolf uh, goes through the whole process of creating a skull. Uh, this is the uh, model that you can buy here. And what he's doing here is just demonstrating uh, the horse's skull and how to create the shapes and uh, all the important things that you need to know to uh, create a, a horse's head. Um, on this video, this first video, he basically shows uh, how to do the skull, and uh, and and then he's going to uh, in the next video. I think he's going to show the muscles, but uh, anyway, let me uh, get to that next video. The first thing you notice is that Jeff dresses a whole lot better than moi, me, <laughs> believe me. And now he's going to basically uh, show how to, uh, let me just uh, zip through this. Uh, he, what he's doing now is uh, finalizing the shape of the skull uh, in this video here, uh, showing how to create the uh, muscles and the uh, nostrils. Uh, properly on the uh, skull. Uh, very instructive. Uh, and now he's going through the muscle uh, using the uh, form that you can buy on uh, the WARA's uh, website uh, of the uh, skull. Uh, and uh, just going through all the uh, shapes and forms. As a, the first video, basically, he starts out telling us about the uh, uh, abstract uh, shapes of the uh, skull and the things that uh, you have to sort of know to be able to create a, a really good skull. In the final video of the uh, uh, three uh, videos that you get on the horse skull, he shows uh, how to finish off the head, uh, you know, the mane and how to create the mane and all that stuff. It's a method that uh, he uses. Uh, everybody has their own method and uh, it's not a bad method. Uh, it, if, you know, I get a lot of questions about how to do the hair and the mane and and stuff like that. And this video, these, this uh, final video, uh, shows a lot about that too. Um, he also has a technique. Uh, he's using, I think, Chavant clay. I'm not certain on that. Um, it, it looks like Chavant. Uh, you can get that from Red Bank, New Jersey. The the uh, Chavant clay. Chavant's a good clay. Um, you can look it up online. Just do a Google search for uh, C H A V A N T, Chavant, and uh, you can buy that clay uh, uh, online and uh, get it shipped to you. My 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 uncle Ed Froten uses uh, Chavant clay. It's a nice clay. On the uh, vi there's a another video set uh, on the humans. There's another video set on the human skull, and uh, he's showing, uh, comparing in the beginning of this video, basically the uh, the exact uh, things that are similar between the uh, human and the horse skull. So on this uh, third disc, and I skipped the second disc because uh, I just wanted to get this uh, out to you as quickly as I can. Uh, the third disc on the human skull, uh, he shows you how to create the muscle structure using uh, this uh, model that he has right there. And now he's showing how to finish off a face and, and a head. Uh, he's, you know, it's just the whole, all three discs have gone through uh, this stuff. This particular disc is a 34 minute uh, long disc or video. And um, I think he gives you some darn good constructive uh, information about 
how to create uh, uh, different things and like that. There's other videos on the, uh, I think, there may be. So anyway, I just uh, would recommend uh, these videos. All right, uh, now this is another video that he has, and he's he's he has this on his website, um, which I will link. Uh, he shows how to create the horse uh, using the uh, horse model that I have, uh, that I bought from uh, uh, them, um, and he goes through this, and is just kind of like a fast forward through the whole thing. But uh, I, I think you get the idea that. Uh, the amount of information that you can get uh, for horse, the uh, muscle uh, structure, uh, how to finish it off, and how to connect, uh, you know, what the muscles are and, and the shapes of them and all that stuff, and then how to move the armature around. This is, uh, a, I guess, a sculpture. Yeah, this is actually a sculpture that's at the foundry that's a pretty amazing uh, horse sculpture, and he points out things about it and stuff like that. And here's a quick view of the whole video that he has on the uh, skull, um, the human skull. I it, just just amazing uh, the information that you get. Uh, he's much better at explaining these things than I am because you know he teaches class in this this sort of thing. And this is uh, the second video uh, showing uh, how he puts the muscles on the face and stuff like that. And then the finalizing the the head now. So as I close out this video with the uh, the horse skull uh, DVD, uh, fast forward through all the DVDs that uh, he put out on that one. There's three of them, um, and how he shows uh, to create the skull and then to do the muscles on the skull and all that stuff. Uh, let me say that uh, I'm putting a link to their website below where you can buy these uh, DVDs and the uh, models as well. Um, just uh, when you purchase, just let them know that uh, I sent you there. Um, and all the information for doing that is in the uh, description in the video uh, below this video. Uh, so uh, I think it's helpful. And uh, they're out there and they're ready to go now. So uh, enjoy.